So moving forward though, let's keep going here. I'm gonna turn this reverb down and I'm gonna put it back at like noon, right? Going to channel two, right? Now we're gonna start getting a little more gainy. I'm gonna put the volume up, right? Gain is going all the way up. Let's just start there. I'm gonna put the bass. Bear with me, I'm so slow. Bass, middle, treble, that's all in the middle. Bridge pickup, let's go. Take the reverb off. That's the mark of a good one right there because you can already keep that, that clarity, right? You can mask a lot with reverb and you can kind of hide a lot of things you might not want. But with this, taking the reverb off still sounds great. Adding that reverb back in. Come on now. Now, what I'm hearing too, I'm gonna add the reverb. I'm gonna kick that mids up a hair, right? Just in the room for me, I'm taking the bass down and I wanna put the treble up a hair and I wanna see if that does anything for me. Oh, for sure, I can feel it right away. And I'm not just saying that, in the room, I can feel it's adjusting the way that I attack the guitar a little bit and it's it's kind of putting me where where I want my ear and my, my kind of physicality to feel. Starting to open up a little bit. And that treble, honestly, I kind of am gonna meet in the middle on that. Oh, that sounds awesome. Sick. I'm gonna go to this mid, uh, this back pickup. Classic like blues tone right there. You can go really far. feels awesome. So that really kind of feels like I wouldn't even need to plug anything else into that. I could just take that right there, right? Now, moving forward, I am going to this blues power. We're going overdrive on this, you know, the second channel. Activating that, right? And let's see where that takes us. Essentially, tying this into the new JJM50, I wanted an amplifier that I did not even need a pedal to just, if I saw it and I needed to play a festival, fly date, bring it out, plug straight into it, I wanted to go into this Blues Power channel and just have it on tap. So essentially, it was just me, uh, my guitar, uh, a cable straight in. And what we're doing right now is we are doing that same thing using the plugin. So right now, this is essentially exactly all I would need to make it through a gig. So. feels like a real amp. It really does feel like a real amp and it reacts too. As I mess around with like, you know, I'm just being dumb now, I'm just moving stuff. But as I mess around, I can literally feel the difference in the weight of the strings, the way it plays. Every time I mess with the actual tonal settings, it changes it, which... So cool. It's all about the feel, it's all about that, and it, it has that in spades. <laughs> 